uh, hello friend welcome back to this lesson uh, in the last video if you look at like uh, uh, we have configured the RDS and in this RDS we have configured the uh, RD gateway as well as that we have created the collection here and we have put it some application you know in this collection okay so and uh, we, we try to access that application through um, uh, um, RD gateway, uh, RD wave, uh, like through web, uh, through web server, and we successfully done that. But today I will teach you how we will do the licensing on the RD um, remote desktop session. Okay, so for that, what you will do first, you need to open, go to the tool here, and there is a terminal server. In the terminal server, there is a, a remote desktop licensing manager. Okay, let's 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 go uh, RD licensing diagnosure here. <coughs> if you if you go here see licensing mode is per user like okay so it is configured as a per user you can configure configure it's a per device also but uh, you know if you want to your know, licensing uh, you know licensing server is not activated if you look at here because it's still not activated if you want to keep the licensing server and you have license then how will do i will show you now just close it and go to the again tool here and there you will go to the terminal server and here remote desktop license manager if you just click over here the remote desktop license manager will be open the window will be open here if you look at what are your server rda servers is there that will come over here but in my in this environment i have only the one rda server this is what fa01 okay if you right click this one so install license is deactivated it's not still active because the server is still not active if you look at here there is a red cross right you need to active the server first of all for that what you will do you just active the server here once you try to active the server it will uh, take you to the active server wizard click the next how will do that it's a select the most appropriate connected method there are three methods are there to you know getting the license one is automatic connection recommended and the web browser and telephone let's take about the telephone first of all if you choose the telephone option here and go to the next it will ask the region like it's india uh, country it will ask the country if you click for the India, see it is telling that the activity license server, please call Microsoft in this number and you tell them the product ID, they will give you the license ID. Okay. Otherwise, what you will do, there is other option also there be browser. Okay. If you click this one, click the next here, what you will the active your license server, go to the remote desktop license website located. If you go to this site, it, it, that internet should be required. If you go to the site, if you give the product ID, then you will get this licensing. There is another option that need the internet connection is required for the automatic connection. If you click the next, it will connect your internet. It will connect the Microsoft site and will get your update, uh, get get your active the servers. Okay. Once it is uh, activated, then you will install the license as well as it automatically install the license. It's once it's activated if you have the license. Okay. So this is the how the way we can do the you know, licensing in RDS. Uh, and uh, you know we can active the license here if you're expired, right? But default it is 120 days for the license. Okay. We need to you know purchase the license for this. Okay. So this is the how the we configure the RDS. I think this is the last video of mine of RDS uh, because we have uh, you know. From beginning to step by step, we have configured the RDS, we have configured the uh, RD gateway, RD license, RD web access, as the RD connection broker also. And we have, if you look at here, like in the same server, I have installed all the roles here and we were done it. Practice also, we will done it, right? And the last, this is the licensing and that also I am done. So I hope guys, uh, you enjoying this video and do not forget to subscribe my channel. If you have any query, any question on this lesion, you can put in comment or you can um, contact me through the mail address as well as my number also there. Uh, you can find out an email uh, like on Facebook, uh, you know, links are there. So you will get it all these things. Otherwise, you can call me for any like uh, training related queries, online training related query. So I can get vacation. Thank you very much.